Winter Landscape with a Bird Trap by Peter Bruegel the Younger. Written by Teresa Yelinkova. Read by Alec Munro. I can see a picture of a village hiding in a yellowish haze of early twilight of a December day. The bitter and cruel frost is biting all the villagers in their faces and making their cheeks red. Their feet and hands are freezing cold. But it cannot stop them from playing and screaming cheerfully all the time. It looks like they don't notice the cold and desperately want to enjoy the rest of the day because the darkness is almost here. The river is sleeping peacefully, covered with stiff and thick ice under their feet. One can imagine how clumsy the villagers must feel in their not really comfortable, heavy winter coats. Let's notice the rural cottages, which are cowering on the river banks. They are wearing heavy white snow hats. We shouldn't miss the high, dark and sad looking trees covered with rough bark. Not even the crows are paying attention to them. They are so hungry that they are looking for food in the white snow, not noticing the trap. The local village church is unbearably sad. Its bells are silently sleeping. The villagers have left it alone to enjoy the lovely winter time. We can hardly see the small nearby town in the back of the picture. Does anybody live there? And is it really a town or is it just a visual illusion? We will never know. The atmosphere of the picture is rather ambiguous. On one side, there is severe winter with a bitter frost that is biting faces and making birds starve. On the other side, we can presume that all the freezing villagers will soon get to their homes where they will take their coats off and have something that will help them warm up. They will spend the rest of the evening with their loved ones, sipping hot tea and eating thick soup.
the next morning, Christmas Day comes.